Nagonusian torched on Smitha. <laughs> Took you long enough. I was beginning to think all this talk of gods and nightmares might have scared you off. I said I would come. So, great artifact hunter, did you track it down as easily as you said you would? Not quite. But after studying this island, I found our next step. I'll lead you to it, if you're ready. On to this next step. This shared expedition is starting to feel tedious. Spoken as if finding an ancient artifact long hidden away was supposed to be simple. Norman Oxon, Edris, and Thame. For pardon, done settle ache. I take it you've been hunting these artifacts for a long time now. <laughs> yes, quite some time. What led you to this? Strangely enough, a vacation gone horribly wrong. Now it has become a destiny of sorts. What exactly are we going to do with this artifact once we find it? I will take it far away from this island for safekeeping. To a place where no one can maliciously wield its power. Power? So it's a weapon of some kind? In the wrong hands, it is. The kind of weapon that should never be used. <laughs> a weapon that shouldn't be used. That sounds like a sentiment spoken by someone too weak to wield its power. It might sound strange to you, but trust me. Its power is not to be taken lightly. The survival of your world depends on that. Somehow, I think, this stone formation will bring us closer to finding the artifact. The great ancient artifact hunter is stumped by a pile of rocks. I... It's not that simple. There's a trick of some kind. Maybe it's a riddle. It is, and I've already solved it. That's it? There's nothing. <laughs> It looks like the Isle of Skye, but there are several markings on it. <gasps> could it? No, it couldn't be... a map? I didn't feel the need to state the obvious. So, what are the markings? There are several triangles, and one X, not too far from here. What are we waiting for? X marks the spot. <whistles> so, do you just spend your days attacking strange women in graveyards, or do you have other duties? I take care of my people. We have a settlement, Ravensthorpe. That must be nice. I've traveled alone for what feels like a lifetime now. You speak as if... How old are you exactly? <laughs> Older than you think. But everyone tells me I have a young face. That's a very pretty bird flying above you. Her name is Sunin. I had a bird once. A long time ago. An eagle named Icaros. I prefer ravens. Eagles are too... Godly? Gaudy.
You're quiet. Not thinking of throwing another axe at my head, are you? No. I'm just not compelled to fill silence like you are. Good. That fight took a lot out of me. Not sure I'm ready for a second. You kept me on my toes as well. Was that... a compliment? Nothing here. Stand right here. Why? Can't you trust me? Or at least pretend to so this goes faster? <sighs> Fine. How did you know? Lots of practice. Another ambush! They must be drawn to the temple. They're very persistent. <laughs> Take your life. I've seen this before. We'll need shards. Keys to place on this pedestal. That should open. No. We need to talk. Those people that attacked us, were they speaking your language? I already told you. The artifact has made them go mad. Cassandra? Eivor, when are you going to see that I'm here to help? Fine. We've come this far together. I trust you have good intentions. Thank you. And if you say you're not hiding anything, I believe you. <sighs> There's a chance that my arrival on the Isle of Sky might be what activated the artifact's powers. But it's not certain. And even if it's true, that's all the more reason for me to remove it. No, that's all the more reason for you to leave, so I can remove it myself. You've done enough. I can't trust you, Cassandra. You have no idea what you'd be dealing with. You need my help. I know what I must do from here. And if those men are after you, it'll be even easier for me to continue by myself. Eivor, please! The powers of this artifact are unlike anything you've seen. Nothing is too powerful for me. Besides, I'm sure I'll make better use of this weapon than you. Ah, fine. I've had enough of you anyway. You're impossible. You're too brash, Eivor. And it will undo you. <laughs> <laughs> 